It is that time of the time of the week. I was about to say time of the month again. Oh my word, that is not a good start to a video. Team of the season is finally here. If you're looking to get yourself any coins from the best supplier in town, check out my sponsor, FIFACoinZone.com, and use the code Haber to get yourself 5% off. It is that time of the week again. It's Thursday. It is rewards day. And of course, we're going to be opening our division rivals, our foot champs, as well as a bunch of other division rivals and foot champs rewards. Hopefully. We got ourselves that red Ronaldo. Now, I finished in rank three this week. Really, the only reason, and I'll be honest with you, the only reason was is because I wanted the two mega packs. Usually, I go for the uh, for the ultimate packs. I've got so many rare plays in my club now. I wanted to get the two mega packs and the 250k packs instead because I want some consumables um, just to put in the club, basically. So, I decided to stay at rank three and not play any, which is actually kind of annoying because I've had to wait until today to do the... Uh, to do the um, What's the word? The objectives. So uh, I'm going to have to do the objectives today instead of doing them midweek, which is a little bit of a hindrance. But you know what? It was my choice at the end of the day, so uh, it's on me. And uh, we're going to start off with a non-board and a 50k pack. It's going to be an 80-rated Heaton. I hope that was a mega pack and not a 50k pack, but I'm pretty sure that was a 50k pack. Was I correct? It was indeed a 50k pack. And uh, as you see... I have a lot of rares in the club, and uh, and majority of them, in fact, most of them are untradeable. So we're just going to discard those. We're going to go for the second 50k pack now. It's pretty sacrilegious to go with the two big packs first, and I didn't realize what I was doing until now. And uh, we have just broken the rules. We've broken the FIFA rules, and we've opened the big packs first, and we've waited to open the smaller packs. But who knows? Maybe the mega packs reward us more than 50k packs this week. Who knows? But, uh, but again, just a testament to how stacked my club is with rares right now it's just it's very stacked so i wanted to go through and get the 50 uh, get the 35k pack for this week sorry so we're going to skip this um and go for our champs reward straight after i don't usually do them separately usually i do them all at the same time but i thought i don't know we'll change things up uh, this week sorry and uh have i got a tradable no we just packed an untradable counterpart didn't we so uh Go ahead and discard those guys because they're pretty much all untradeable. Uh, and open the last mega pack for rival rewards. Probably going to have no walkouts this week. Yeah, no walkouts this week from rivals. It is what it is. You know, we've got some consumables in the club. I think next week I'll definitely get the uh, get the ultimate pack though because we want to get at least some walkouts and rival rewards. And we've got a, three Ruffiers. Three Ruffiers out of four packs. That has got to be some kind of record. Okay. Time for champs now, and in a similar fashion, I finished in gold two this week. Now, I went 17 and four, and then on Sunday night, I was very bored, and I was like, you know what? I'm going to go into games, I'm going to give people wins. And ironically, out of the nine games I gifted people wins, two people thanked me. Two people. Two people thanked me. I thank everyone that gives me wins, because people never do. So anyway, off topic, let's get into the, uh, let's get into the, um... What are these things called again? Player, player picks. Here we go. We've got four players to get. One Serie A guaranteed in both of these. Please let it be Ronaldo. Here we go. Come on. What's it going to be? Oh, 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 my word. Oh, my word. Oh, oh my word. I, don't, I actually don't know what to pick. I genuinely don't. Do I go with, with Izzo? He's got an incredible look. No, we've got to go with Quagliarella. Ho. Oh. EA, thank you so much. That is the best player pick I have had this year. This year. That is incredible. Second one. Come on. Oh, my word. <laughs> oh, my word. Okay, so we're going with Izzo as well. I actually thought that was Delict at first, but it was Blind. Um, I, I had a mini heart attack. We're going with Izzo and Quagliarella. In my opinion, those two sets of player picks were incredible. These two players from Gold 2 in my opinion, is incredible. A fantastic looking centre-back, an incredible looking striker. We'll store those both in the club and we'll open up the rewards and see what we can get in the packs. Now, we do have a 25k pack followed by two 55k packs. I actually really like rare mega packs, so we'll see if we can get some good in the rare mega packs. So we're going to start off with a 25k pack that I'm guessing we'll have nothing in, but we get tradable rares that we can discard for coins. So we'll take that at least. Um, we're going to get Morata, Pedro and Diene, who was, of course, team of the season last week. Uh, we'll discard those. Now we have two rare mega packs. I am so happy with the red picks I just got. I am so happy. Quagliarella and Izzo are both incredibly usable players. They are incredible looking players and they are very high rated. And they're definitely a step up from, for example, 
uh, Parejo and Santi Cazorla I got last week, or the week before that, Sommer and Trap, or the week before that, I think I got Laporte, um, and I forget the other two, but they weren't amazing. Like, I, I haven't had amazing players, so to actually, actually have a week where I get amazing players is a breath of fresh air, and I am very, very happy about that. Okay, second pack now, second rare mega pack to round off my account. No walkouts in any of the packs this week, but it made up for it with the incredible red player picks. So I'm pretty happy with uh, with the look I've had in player picks this week. I think it's pretty hard not to be happy with that kind of look. I'm very, uh, very satisfied. So we'll go ahead and store those. We'll discard the rest. Let's go and open some more rewards and see what we can get some other people. Let's do it. Now it is time to open up Georgia rewards. He has finished, of course, in Rivals in Rank 2 to get himself the two ultimate packs. Let's see if it would have paid off. Well, I guess it's not the most accurate representation, but let's see if I should definitely be going for Rank 2 every week by the ultimate packs that George gets. Now, George also finished in Foot Jumps in Elite 3. Three. He was at 1.17 and 0, and then sadly had a crash and went 17 and I think 3 and ended 23 and 4, which is very disappointing. I think very soon he's going to be getting that 27, 28, 29 victory point in champions. And uh, hopefully when he does, we can open his rewards because that'll be sick. Regardless, we've got three player picks now. Uh, he actually sent me a list. He wants Ronaldo, Cancelo, Nangolan, Dumfries, Donnarumma, Koulibaly, RVP, Gomez, and then the rating in that order. So let's try and satisfy him. Now we went front to back last time. Usually I start in the middle when we've got a leap. I'm going to go front to back again and see what we can get. And my uh, my dual shot battery is very low. And we've got him a on a rumor okay not a bad start it is a player on his list so we will take that and remind myself to charge my controller after this as well so it's a very very good start 95 rate team of the season card right there let's go into the next one come on okay i mean it's decent don't get me wrong they're decent picks but uh, we've already packed some untradeable team this is now Chihuahua or El Shirawe, Um and we just go with Donnarumma. So we're going to go with Fabian here because he's already got a team of the season El Shirawe. Uh So we're going to go ahead and take Fabian there. And then for the last player pick, can it be someone on his list? Please EA, come on, be someone good. Oh, okay. We've got him Izzo. Now Izzo isn't higher rating than Ilicic. Ugh, tough one here. I'm actually going to ask him who he wants to pick because... I think this is the fifth Ilicic he's packed, but Izzo looks like a decent card, so I'm going to ask him. George has picked Ilicic. <laughs> yeah, this, I think, genuinely is like the fourth or fifth time that he's actually got an Ilicic in his club now, an untradeable Ilicic. This one's, of course, red. Uh, I think he's just throwing them into SBCs now, but at least we got one player on his list in Donnarumma, and it wasn't even that low on his list. I think he was about mid-tier, so it's not the worst in the world as well. Now what we have is two ultimate packs, a 100k pack, and a premium Serie A Tots pack. So, here we go. First one, we've got the ultimate pack here from Division Rivals. Let's see a walkout, EA. Not a walkout in the first pack. That's not a good start. That's not a good start, sadly. Can it be something decent, like an 85, maybe? It's going to be English, Cam, Deli Alley. I don't think there is an 85 rated English board job. It, correct me if I'm wrong, but I just can't think of one on the top of my head. Uh, I guess we'll take it. There's a few 84s in there. That's not actually too bad. Um, we'll go ahead and send Parolo. Oh, yeah, these are, these are untradeable. Totally forgot. I was going to say send Parolo to the transfer list. Uh, second ultimate pack now. Come on, EA. Show me that walkout symbol in this pack at least. Wow. Okay, two ultimate packs, no walkout. Maybe not wasting my time. I say wasting my time. I say that lightly. Maybe not grinding towards uh, the ultimate packs. Wasn't the worst decision in the world for me. Um, this week, so uh, so not too bad. Okay, we'll take an 84 at least, but you know we want those walkouts really in ultimate packs. They're uh, they're the most expensive, biggest pack on the game. Not getting a walkout kind of feels like a kick in the teeth. Regardless, we do have a 100k pack now. I wonder if a step down from an ultimate pack will give us a walkout. Let's have a look. Will a step down give us the walkout? No, it will not. Wow. Okay, we're still yet to get a walkout in any of the packs we've opened so far. Surprising. It's going to be Jekko, 85 rated, closest you can get to a uh, walkout without being a walkout, sorry. So, um, okay, 285s in there. Not the worst in the world. Um, we'll send you to the transfer list because you're Syria, and we'll go ahead and discard those. Now we've got the big boy pack, the premium Syria Tots pack. One of the expensive ones would go down an absolute treat here. It really, really would. In terms of the Serie A Tots, uh, the most expensive ones we are looking for, of course, Ronaldo straight away. Then Nangolan, uh, Cancelo, Chiellini, Alejandro Gomez, uh, Koulibaly, Quagliarella. Zapata's very expensive as well. Um, any of those would be nice. Any Anyone that sells for a good chunk of money will be very nice, EA. Here we go. Show me the Portuguese flag. Come on. Show me the Portuguese flag.
Oh my word, that's good. That's very good. That is very, very, very good. 95 rate Alejandro Gomez. He goes for 550,000 coins on the PlayStation market. And that's not the only thing. Being 95 rated, there is still room to get a Nangolan. There's still room to get a Zhao Cancelo. There's still a possibility of a Chiellini. There's three right there. We can still get a Zapata, a Piontek. Any of the boys that are 200k like Chiesa, El Shadawe, Korea. There is still potential to have an incredible pack here. Oh my word. What else have we got? Uh, you know what? That isn't that bad, okay? So, Lazari sells for 30k. Ilicic is uh, about 100k, so... All in all, I think he's made about 700,000 coins there, which is sick. Do not get me wrong. It's very, very good. Um, obviously, we were hoping for a little bit better there. But to get a 95, a 94, not bad. Obviously, there was, there was always going to be 187 in there. Yeah, you're just going to throw them in there for the bans. But you know what? Pretty solid, if you ask me. Pretty solid indeed. So we'll go ahead and take those. Let's go on to some more rewards. Now it's time for Billy's rewards. Now, Billy is a newcomer to the channel. Uh, he has just hit Elite for the first time this week, he said. And I very much hope we can make it worth it. So we've got untradeable division rivals, rank two rewards, and division one. We'll go ahead and claim those those two ultimate packs right there. And we have his foot champions rewards, his first ever elite finish. Congratulations, first of all, Billy. GG's on that. That is absolutely incredible. Let's hope we can get him something good. Now he sent me a list as well. Now let's check out the list. Uh, let me read the list out for you guys first. It's Ronaldo Delict, De Jong Cancelo, Nine Golan, Kula Bali, Alejandro Gomez, Quagliarella, and Ziek. And if none of those, he said, uh, pick rating or he'll trust me to pick. So, come on. Show me one from that list, EA, please. Oh, Quagliarella straight away. Let's go. 96 rated Quagliarella. Let's take it. Come on. I just said let's take it. You know what I mean. I meant, I meant to say let's go. We'll take it. Okay. Moving on. Second player pick. That's a great start. That is a great start. Tadic in there. Now, Tadic isn't on his list kind of frustrating because we really do want to hit like a, a De Jong or a De Ligt or a Ronaldo, of course. Um, I'm actually going to pick out of the 295s. I think the most linkable here is Donnarumma. So I think we'll go with Donnarumma. Third and final player pick now. Come on, EA. Please. 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 Okay. All right. We've got Tadic again. Now, Piontek. The thing is, Piontek is decent. But Tadic is higher rated. And I think for SBC purposes, we're going to go with Tadic here uh, over Piontek. Just because I think that he will want the, the higher rated. He's just got an incredible striker. He will want the higher rated for SBC. So 295s and a 96 is a fantastic set of player picks. Especially one of them being Quagliarella. That is very, very decent. Now, let's go to store and let's open up some uh, packs now. So, we've got the Rare Legend Players Pack. Now, this one here. Premium Serie A Oh, yeah, of course, Elite Rewards. What am I talking about? So this one here is from the Alexandra SBC. This is, this is tradable. And it's a walkout. Go on. And it's a blue. Go on. Italian. Right wing. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah, just throw that at me, why don't you? Just throw that at me. We'll take it. Oh, my word. Let's go. You what? We just packed a 200,000 coin uh, team of the season out of the Alexandro pack. What a pack. I don't even know how to... I was, I genuinely was not expecting that. I thought it was going to be like an 80 rated card. I wasn't... I genuinely wasn't expecting a board. Um, I don't think if Dion plays sell anymore. I don't know. They don't. Um, I don't know which silver sell for anything. That is incredible. Let's go. Come on. We'll send that to the transfer list. It's a 200,000 coin card. I, I, there's people sleeping, so I'm trying not to wake everyone up right now. But that is incredible. That is actually an incredible start. Come on. Evidently, Billy's account is the lucky account. I'm guessing. That is a fantastic start. I, I genuinely, that's caught me off guard. I wasn't expecting that. I was about to be like, okay, 80 rated card, the burnout in there, it was, what, oh, the Benyat, sorry, was what I was expecting the entire pack to be. So, fantastic. Okay, ultimate pack now. Come on, EA. Show us a walkout. Wow, the ultimate packs today have been absolutely terrible. They've been absolutely awful. That's actually very surprising. Okay, we've got Mkhitaryan in there, but it's like, not great. Not fantastic rivalry awards today. In fact, I think apart from that rare election plays pack there, uh, I'm pretty sure we are yet to see any walkouts from any packs that aren't team of the season packs. Hopefully this 100k pack here will change it, but 
yeah, no, the look seems pretty poor right now in terms of the uh, non-team of the season pack. As we say that, we do get ourselves a walkout. It's not a blue, though. It's an inform. We have got a good team of the week as well. Who's this? Okay, Rondon. I didn't actually realize Rondon was in this team of the week. But we do have a good team of the week. Like, there's some very good players. Okay, we'll take that. Not too shabby. We'll take a Rondon. 86 rated as well. So, it's tradable. And it's a decent rated. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, okay. So, three informs in one pack. And Hyung Min Son. I think they hold decent value right now as well. About 30,000 coins for Rondon. 25,000 coins for Barella. Areeb's probably about 15k. We'll send those to the transfer list. And Son will store the rest. Any dupes, we'll send those to the transfer list as well, just in case he wants to save them. I don't know. Um, but we do have a premium Serie A Tots pack now. Can we top Alejandro Gomez? It's going to be incredibly difficult to do that. But if we top the last pack, we're probably packing one of the incredible high-rated ones that sell for a huge amount of coins. So let's try it. Here we go. Come on. We see Portugal, man. I don't I, I genuinely do I don't know how I would react. I don't actually know how I would react if we just packed Ronaldo. Italian centre back, Chiellini. Chiellini. 95 rated Chiellini. Very, very, very good start. High rated. 400,000 coin player right there. Fantastic entry. Let's see if we can get anything good in the rest of the pack. If we can get some like 93s and 94s in this pack, it could be a fantastic, fantastic pack. Let's see. Let's see what this holds. That is decent. That's actually very, very good. So Keelene is about 415k, 200k for Chiesa, 150k for Fabian. So in total, it's about 750,000 coins. That is actually a fantastic pack. I would, I don't know, I can't see any complaints with that at all. That is actually fantastic. That is a phenomenal pack. EA are gifting the elite players some good stuff this week. That is actually sick. Let's open some more rewards. Now it's time for Sam's rewards. So in Rivals, Sam has got himself rank one in Division 1. We get two Ultimate Packs and two Mega Packs, which is obviously very nice to open. Although the Ultimate Packs this week haven't seemed that great. They just haven't. So we'll see how they go on. And he actually got Gold 1 in Weekend League. Very close to Elite 3 this week. Unfortunately, um, we saw a case of the old bottle this week for Sam in Elite Foot Champions. But... I think this upcoming weekend, we'll see a much better result. Hopefully, we can make it a bit easier on him with a team of the season red, Ronaldo. Who knows? Let's open. Let's see. First player pick. Now, he did send me a list, actually. And that's actually a decent start. He did send me a list uh, for reds here. Ronaldo, Nangolan, Cancelo, Gomez, and then rating. So, we're going to go with Donnarumma because it's easier to link, I feel like. Next player pick, though. Hopefully, we can get either Ronaldo, Nangolan, Cancelo, Alejandro, Gomez. And if not, we just get another maybe 95 would be great. Let's see. Oh, okay. See, uh, it's annoying because I know he'd want the rating. I would love to be able to pick this card, but he will want rating. That card just looks phenomenal though. Okay, anyway, not bad. Pretty decent set of rewards there. I would be very happy with that. If I was in gold, I'm lying. I wouldn't. I'm very happy with what I got and I can't lie. I'm sorry. I'm just very happy with what I got. And I would not, like, given what I've got, given what I've got this week, I would not be happy with that. But if I didn't know what I'd already got, you know what I'm saying. Anyway, I'm going to stop waffling. We're opening up Mega Packs now. We're opening up some packs. We want to get some walkouts. We want to see some decent players. Come on, EA. Let's see some decent stuff here. We're opening up the first Mega Pack, and we've had nothing so far. Let's see with the second Mega Pack. Come on, EA. Show me a walkout. Show me a walkout. No walkout in this one. We're going to skip it. We don't even care. Even if it's an 85 we don't care. We want to see walkouts right now. An 84, not bad, actually. <laughs> a thousand coins in there as well. We'll take it. Um, go ahead and discard those badges and that player. We've got two ultimate packs now. Come on, EA. Please, show me a walkout. Come on. There we go. Finally, an ultimate pack with a walkout. But it's not blue. It's an inform, though. Could it be one of the good ones? It's going to be... Oh, who's this? Arnautovic? Arnautovic? 87 rated on Altovic. That's actually not bad at all. We'll take that. I, I I didn't I know that's a good team of the week. I just didn't really do my homework on who was in it. On Altovic shells for about 35,000 coins to 40,000 coins. It's not too bad actually. I know Gabriel Jesus is in it. I know I know I know who everyone is in it now because I've just had a look at the uh I've just had a look at Footbin. But that's not bad actually. I mean, he's not tradable, but it's an 87 rated inform for SBCs. I know Sam completes a lot of icon SBCs. So I'm guessing it will have some kind of use in the club. Anyway, second ultimate pack now. Come on, let's have back-to-back -back walkouts. Wow. Come on, EA. 
Don't do this. We want to see back-to-back -back walkouts. That's the important thing. We want to see some walkouts. Sadly, we're not getting them here. I'm going to go ahead and discard those players. We've got 200k packs now. This is where I want to see something good. These are the tradable packs. Come on, EA. Show us something decent. Let's get some coins in the club. Really? Yikes, man. The look in the in the, the normal like bog standard packs this week just hasn't been there. But the play picks have been on point. The play picks have been incredible, man. Play picks have been incredible. Regardless, let's go ahead and discard that. Let's go. Come on. Second 100k pack now. Come on, EA. Please show me a walkout. Ouch. That's painful. We've got one more set of rewards, though. So don't go anywhere. We've got another set of rewards. This video is going to be a long video. Holy moly. This is going to be a very long video. But we have got one more set of rewards. So we'll go ahead and open those now. They are Simon's rewards. He did play this week, despite actually now being a father so let's uh let's go and open his reward so last up are simon's rewards he actually doesn't actually play rivals during the week at all he plays his champs games and then he does nothing all week on fifa pretty much so uh we'll go ahead and take his rank three rewards two mega packs 250k packs uh we've also got his champs rewards he finished in gold one this week um, so we've got two uh, play picks of four items. He got to 17 and 8, I think, and then just couldn't be bothered. I think he I think he must have gone on late at night and just finished his last three. But as he's just had a new baby in the last sort of month, uh, you can understand why he's been, not been playing weekend league at all. I, I personally would understand it. So first player pick now. Let's see if we can get in one of the big boys. Come on. Okay, that's a very good start. Zapata is an incredible looking card. This card looks phenomenal. Six foot two with 96 jumping, 99 strength, 99 head accuracy. That is a phenomenal, phenomenal looking card. We'll go ahead and take Zapata in the first one. First time we've seen Zapata this video as well. They've been pretty, pretty similar apart from uh, apart from this this account apparently. We've actually this is the first time I've seen Mancini as well. We'll go ahead and take Piatek or Piontek as the uh, highest rated card there. Easiest to link as well, I would say. Not too shabby. Zapata, in my opinion, is the better one of those two as well. Um, Simon actually packed himself, I think, Tots Quagliarella in his guarantee pack. So, uh, so I'm guessing he's going to go with Quagliarella and possibly um, the super sub of, of Zapata on the bench, I would imagine. Anyway, we've got two 100k packs, two 50k packs, two 35k packs. Let's start with the 35ks. Let's fill Simon's club up with some decent players here, eh? I know that his, his untradables are looking a little bit sort of shoddy. Um... In the past few weeks, he hasn't really been playing rivals, and so we haven't had rival rewards. And we've been using a lot of his untradables in the uh, in the team of the season guarantee pack. So to fill up the club a little bit would be very nice, and that'd be great with a with a decent little walkout here. Let's have a look. It's going to be German centre mid. Cruz is a fantastic card to fill the club with. That is decent. Ninety rated fills the club up nicely. Could also be some other players in the pack. Who knows? That is a good filler. That is a very good club filler right there. Going to be great for an SBC. Absolutely nothing else in the club. But you know what? We'll go ahead and take Cruz. That is a great walkout to get. We've got two 50k packs now. Let's see if we can get something nice in one of these 50k packs. Come on, EA. No walkout in this one, sadly. It's going to be a board. We'll take that. What's it going to be? It's going to be German goalkeeper. Okay, Bernard Leno, 84 rated again. Like, untradables are nice right now. The, the ones that will fill up the club nicely, like 384s right there are always the nicest ones. They're going to be very helpful for uh, upcoming guaranteed packs. Second 50k pack now. Come on, EA. Show us something decent. It's a walkout. That's a great start. It's not a blue. Could be something good. What's it going to be? It's going to be... Skriniar. 86 rate. Every time I see that, I think uh, Hamsik, but I don't know if Hamsik's in packs anymore. I don't know if he actually moved from Napoli or not. I actually don't know. Because I'm pretty sure he was going to be moving from Napoli. I don't know if he actually did move from Napoli or not. I don't know if he moved from Napoli, if he's still in packs or not. I don't know. Anyway, two 100k packs now. Come on, EA. Let's see some walkouts. First one's not a walkout. We're just going to skip it. We don't care about non-walkouts here, EA. We're just going to skip the non-walkouts. It's going to be a few 84s. Kyle kind of Walker, actually. Damn. I don't know how much he sells for. Still about 15,000 coins. Not too bad. We'll take that. Uh, discard the rest. Second 50k. Sorry, 100k pack now. Let's see a walkout. Let's see a blue, EA. Come on. Let's see a blue. It's not a walkout. Very poor ending to a very decent video, if you ask me. The red picks in this video have been incredible. I'm just very happy with what I personally got. I think I'm very happy with what I got for the elite players. I think Simon would be happy with what he got. I think most people in this video will be very happy with what they got bar Sam. Unfortunately, Sam pulled this the, the short end of the straw here. But you know what? I think it's been pretty decent. If you have enjoyed, leave a like down below. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new around here. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you later.